Hi and welcome to another video. In this video, we're going to look at how you could set a position to the Dynamixel motor. To get started, we're going to open the Arduino software. Next, we're going to import the library. It's going to be the Bioloid library. The hardware for this tutorial is the same as the previous video, so if you haven't already done so, go ahead and watch the previous video. Alright, next we're going to type, create our void setup function and our loop function. Now to set the position to the Dynamixo motor, it's pretty simple. So it's gonna be, um, so it's gonna be the you're gonna call the function set position, and this function takes two parameters. The first one being the ID of the Dynamixo motor. In my case, it's gonna be my um, it's gonna be ten, and if you've never set an ID to your motor before, the default is gonna be one. And the second parameter is going to be the position. So it's going to be from 0 to 1023 with 512 being the middle. So um, in our setup function, I'm going to start it at 0 to make sure that it's at 0. Alright, for the void loop, I'm going to set the position of my motor to the middle position, and then we'll delay it for uh, one second, and then we'll go ahead and set the position to 1023, which is the maximum, and then we'll go of delay for one second and then we'll set the position back to zero so the program I've written here should uh, start off at zero and then go to the middle and then all the way to the other end and then go back to zero and it's gonna loop uh, it's gonna loop here so let's check it. Alright, so make sure that your board is set to the robotics, set to the right serial port, and um, your programmer should be the MK2 serial. Alright, so let's load up our program. Alright, so it looks like one second might be a little bit too fast, so let's try uh, two and a half seconds. <laughs> 